Many of this is being done with the connivance of the Electoral Commission and some armed tax parading as members of Ghana's reverse security agencies. We've seen some men in uniform from the military perpetrate this unacceptable act resulting in loss of life. We have seen some reported deaths in Techima, two, one in Sablugu, with the trigger happy military shooting all around. On some occasions, attacks in uniform and their quest to help the EC overturn election results in favor of Nana Adudankwa and his party have shot, maimed, and killed innocent citizens of our republic. We witnessed it, as he said, in Techima Sab, Sabulugu, Odododio, Upper Denchira West, Sabuyasi, and other constituencies. We know, as I've indicated, that we won Techima Sab, and it was declared favorably for the NDC and its candidate. We will not accept anything less. We will not accept anything less than the addition of Techima Sab as one to give us that majority in parliament. We pray the good Lord bestows his best blessings on our nation. We console the brave families, heal those who have sustained various degrees of wounds during this election period. And to the dead, may their soul rest in perfect peace. It's never been the wish of Excellency John Dramani Mahama that a blood will be shed for him to attain the ultimate of being president. Under no circumstance should our beautiful country lose human lives, not even one, in the name of electing a president who, when he sees his losing and losing his parliament, hardly hides behind the military and some police officers have qualified as some there are still professionals within them and amongst them to do that. Stay safe and be assured that the spurious declaration of the 2020 presidential election by the Electoral Commission of Ghana will not be accepted by us as a party. It remains an attack on our democracy and a blot on the conscience of those who have perpetrated those acts to undermine the integrity of the election. We will resist it. For emphasis, let me repeat, we roundly reject and outrightly reject the declaration of the sitting president as the winner of the 2020 presidential elections. In due course, our flag bearer excellency John Dramani Mahama will address the nation and the international community supported by vivid and technical evidence of art up to make up the supposed 51 plus something percent for someone. I thank you very much.